Should couples be with the same personality and characters? I, I really don't think so. Uh, but the, 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 if you have the same personality, most times uh, they say unlike poles attract. But uh, for me, I think like a pose in a couple should attract. Because if we are good, we are good. Let, let us mix up and make a better life altogether. But the biggest challenge I think me have seen in relationship is people accepting uh, that it's not all about them. You understand? Because you, are, you, you have yourself. You, you can decide what to do. You, you feel a certain way about certain things. And you, you understand how certain things are being done in your own culture, in your own way of growing up, in your own environment, in the schools you went to. Are you saying that the disagreement between couples is because the other person refused to think for the, for the spouse? For the good of the both of them. Okay, so are you telling me that your spouse needs to think for the good of the both of you? Exactly. Are and you going? To, are you going to do the same? Yeah, and and, and for me, this uh, I, I put it up to one towards emotional intelligence. Okay. Can you elaborate that in a much simpler word? Words. Okay. okay. Give us example. Ex emotional intelligence. Let me give you an example. I like uh, eating katogo. Katogo is matoke or banana meal mixed either with ginuts or beef or beans. It's my delicacy. I like it. If I start my day with it, I, even if I don't eat lunch, I can go up and, you know, do all my work. You understand? I would expect my wife, for example, or my house help, or nanny, or whoever is helping me to prepare that for me. If they cannot prepare that for me, let, let me say I slept in a hotel, that would be my breakfast order. You understand? But in all these circumstances, where I'm in a, whether I'm in a hotel, whether I'm in a home, I should be able to understand that the people were supposed maybe to provide me with that and not in a position to do so at some point. You understand? So, should I leave home when I'm disappointed because I've not had Katogo? Of course, no. My emotional intelligence won't give me that. You understand? So, inter emotional intelligence means understanding and feeling more for that person. Ability before to, Ability to strain yourself mm. from too much excessive set of focus okay yeah that makes sense so okay that makes sense so uh, so are you saying that if your wife has failed to serve you like what you have expected in marriage um it it doesn't cause you disappointment because you have the ability to think what is the reason behind that that you know that absence that failure it's it's even bigger than that you, you know you can be disappointed but the question is how long are you disappointed okay you cannot yeah. be disappointed from home you drag it to your workplace you drag it to your mm. businesses you drag it to your flight mm. the entire that's day that's true you remain gloomy mm. you remain disappointed you mm. cannot associate with anyone why because you missed your katogo come on uh, uh, it has to be it's not about the katogo that. now it's about dragging your frustrations exactly. for a long time yeah. so how many minutes should someone be frustrated and disappointed is any there such a time any natural person can be frustrated but how long should it take mm, mm. I, I depending on how we are and how strong we are because we face the things at different levels of you know strength you mm. know so I, I wouldn't put it to a time but for me mm. I would say as soon as possible move on okay okay <laughs> I like that that's nice yeah. Are you listening there, husbands and wife? We have our first ever podcast from Mr. Hassan Hamza Yiga. We'll see you guys on the next episode. And if you have any more questions about business, relationships, money, family, kids, friendships, and anything else in the planet of the earth, let us know and we will try to get back to you. Cheers. <laughs>